What up guys, it is Xpony and today we are doing Heading Fibred Episode 5 and you know in this episode we're going to develop a bit more into the squad and we're going to have some epic games for you guys as well. So we're going to go into the first game with a nice little German squad, a few bronzes in there, a few decent goal players, nothing special but quite a bit of chemistry and we're going to win a penalty early on. You know, we're always going to convert these penalties with someone in our team. And we've got Chris Burt to bang that one in to the top right. Um, good signing, right wing. He's got those four-star skills. We know he can shoot from distance. As you can see, a beautiful hit from Milsom. Just going to pick it back up, though. Fake shot, do a left foot curler into the top corner, which is a beautiful goal from the bronze kid. Um, I think he's got about... Six 70 shooting or 69 shooting for a bronze which is pretty epic only really second to um, Gary Gardner who we know has got an absolute massive hit on him we're going to play the ball too to Yaya Sumahuru who can uh, you know hit it on his left foot and he's just going to put that in the bottom corner to make it 3-0 and that's how the game's going to end really um, the guy wasn't amazing but you know he could defend um, it wasn't that good at attacking but you know we'll take the 3-0 you know two shots in target from him 14 from me what can you say um probably should have scored a few more goals as you can see we're just going to relist a few of the silvers that I haven't sold you know I really want to get um, maximum trading profit from these guys and you can see two lads I oh know four people have actually sold now after relisting them um, we did pick up a few lads we've got Moses who eventually sells for a thousand coins uh, you know we've got big legly king we've got big you know loads of random guys um we can we sell on for a bit we're going to buy a new player which is Triore left back for QPR and he is Senegalese and he's going to link in nicely with our squad got decent pace um, I think it's 83 and just a decent overall player 71 rated um, and I found he's a very good left back you know he's got the pace to keep up with the strikers and you know he's good going forward against these sort of teams so we're going to go and play this guy with three decent players, Hernandez, Boateng and Perlo. But unfortunately we randomly disconnect from the servers. Um, I have no reason why I didn't disconnect from the PSN, it was just the servers. So I think that comes out as a loss on our record, I'm not sure. Um, pretty annoying, but what can we do guys, it's EA. So you can see the guys that have sold that we recently put up. A few decent plays there we've got a few coins for. But we're going to go straight into the next game. Not buying any more plays because, you know, a bit annoyed about not finishing that game. And he's got a, I think it's a, I'm not sure who's it up front. Might be Giroud for PSG. But we're going to get a header early on from Big Morrison who I think is our bronze centre-back. As you can see, he clearly has got a bit of a head on him. I'm going to play it through to Zaha and we like Zaha very much. Nice little... Nick past the keeper and then Yaya Sumahoro with a fancy L2 circle finish. Back heels it into the back of there and he's going to go on a nice little run here. I think it's Grenier, I'm not sure. But he just goes through my whole defence. I don't know how. No, it's Gami Gamero. I'm not sure. Not really heard him before. Um, but he gets the goal to make it 2-1 and we're just going to nicely slot a goal in there from Chris Burke to make it 3-1. And that's how the game's going to end. Um, he was a decent opponent, to be honest. Didn't have the strongest of team, though. Uh, good striker, though, Gamiero showed that he can actually dribble through um, my defence. But as you can see, standard result. Um, I, um, I think I've got 16 shots on target, and he's got one. But we're actually going to go and buy another player here, um, which is our goalkeeper. And you may see a centre-back we're going to get later on in the series. But this is Al Munia from Arsenal. Nice little silver play in the right formation. I think we purchased him for around 1-2k, to 2K, which is pretty decent for a bronze keeper with those sort of stats and in the right formation. He does play in the Premier League. Um, I mean, doesn't go as much as the other guys because he is Spanish. I'm going to get Iago Falque, who I'm a big fan of. Four-star skill of Southampton. Uh, pretty average shooting, but his dribbling and his passing are very nice. And they're going to slot into the squad very nicely to increase our chemistry up. So we've got a bit of a Spanish linking up at the back with Almunia Net, the right back Laura, and the centre mid Iago Falque. And you probably saw the centre back we're going to get. So, um, yeah, that sort of ruins that, but we are going to get him a little bit later in the series. But we've not finished the team yet. Uh, so I think it's two more players to go, and then we're going to start a new squad. And I might be uh, seeing if I can sell all the squad, and then we're going to see what's the most, uh, what's the, all the money I get overall, and buy a sick player, and then build up from that. So, as you can see, this guy's got a very average team, four Argentinian golds. 
not going to cause me a lot of problems at all. So as you can see here, I think it's Laura going in and a beautiful goal slotted in there. Uh, did rebound out, I think, I'm not sure, um, to Chris Burke to make it 1-0. But a great ball over the top to Burke, who we know has got a bit of pace. And he's just going to dink it back across the net for Zahar to do a nice little sort of... Um, scorpion kick finish there uh, into the empty net and to be honest we'll take that 2-0 and it's 3-0 in the end but um, I think my PVR cut out uh, midway through which is really annoying it occasionally does happen now but what can you do and a lot of shots in target as usual but anyway guys hope you've enjoyed this episode sorry it's a bit rushed um, got a lot of stuff to do but I'll probably make a new episode again in about four days uh, depending on time constraints but anyway guys it's been Alex Brown and I'll see you next time